Uh, very bittersweet day for me because in my third year here, I'm developing a lot of good relationships with a lot of these young men and women up front and the investment that they've made here at Roosevelt High School. I've seen that firsthand and it's, it's a really sad day for me, but exciting day. Waiting for the moment my whole senior year and it's finally here and just to calm the nerves and just sign and make everything official, so it's awesome. I mean, ever since a little kid I've always dreamed of playing college football, but and now that it's a reality, it's kind of amazing that I've made that step, but we'll see what the future holds for me, I guess. It's a really proud moment. Um, I mean, just all the steps along the way, it, there has been a little stress and a little pressure and, you know, big decisions, but um, I've really kind of, it's opened my eyes to um, kind of what a grown man he is and how well he handles these situations, and so it's a very proud moment. Well, I woke up this morning and it was super nerve-wracking because I was like, I'm basically signing away my next four years and everything, you know, to go play for college, and I'm super excited. It's like, it's a big step to be able to like say, yeah, I'm going to Mount Marty to go play volleyball, so I'm excited. Um, super exciting. I've been looking forward to this for a long time and finally deciding on where I want to go and going in the future, it's going to be fun. I have never honestly had two girls attend the same the same college, which I think is, is great. Maddie and Michaela are really good friends, so I think it shows with their, their dedication on the court, and they, they'll push each other on the court and off the court. It's going to be amazing. She's one of my best friends, and we, we do get along really well on the court together, and it'll be unstoppable. Well, we were talking, Austin and I, as we were walking over here, I said, you know, it's been quite a journey, you know, going back, starting with junior football, and this is something we really didn't expect or think about over the years. I think my sophomore season I kind of set a goal. I want to play college football and uh, worked really hard and should I put my name out there and I'm signing today so I'm pretty excited about that. That was my place right away you know and he was recruited by several schools so and he he always made sure that he let me know that it was going to be his decision and that he wanted to explore all the opportunities and options but uh, thankfully, his mother and I were real happy that he, did, that he chose SDSU. That was our first choice. Thurl was on campus when he was a baby when I was taking class, and my mom was watching him while I was in class. So it's just kind of, I tried not to use that to, you know, I really tried to make it, it neutral so it was his decision only. You know, I didn't want to pressure him, but deep down inside, I'm just like rooting for USF, like, come on. And so, you know, he, uh, when he kind of finally went to that last visit, um, he just, he, he felt it and he was like, yep, this is for me. So we were all just really excited. Anything else that you just want to say about your, your high school career, about going forward, anything you're thinking today? Go Jacks.